May we gather in the clutch of such a silence. Minnesota soldiers in Fort Hood, Texas, preparing to deploy overseas, honored Chief Warrant Officer 2 Charles Nord, Sergeant Court Plantenberg, and Chief Warrant Officer 2 James Rogers. James is a guy I could write in a whole room in the Minnesota Guard and Charlie Company. Lots, one of the best guys I know. Soldiers who knew and served with them got up to share about their personalities. On Rogers, who always encouraged people to call him by his nickname. He'd also like to answer his phone with, you're on with Bobcat, when you try to get a hold of him. Plattenberg, known for long conversations with others about a shared love of fishing. And Nord, the practical jokester. When he'd go to sleep at night, he could expect to wake up to having a Bluetooth speaker placed right next to his head, playing anything from late 90s music to meowing cats. These Minnesota soldiers are about to be deployed to Kuwait, where the fallen soldiers return from in May. Sergeant Cook Plattenberg! A poignant moment in the service, a final roll call, with a reminder Plattenberg, Rogers, and Nord will never again be there to answer. With the soldiers gone, their friends promise their legacies will live on. For all the people in Charlie Company, those stories are alive and will continue to be told. Lou Raguse, CARE 11 News. We don't know what caused the helicopter to crash. The investigation led by the Army could actually take months. A Minnesota organization beyond the Yellow Ribbon has created a memorial fund to help the families of the three soldiers. We have more information on that fund on our website at care11.com.